Drill number one, narrow stance, working the hinge at the hips, taking the chest parallel to the ground, back is flat. You're gonna do five reps, hold number five. Set two, a little wider than hips, flex at the knees, working the hinge. Same exercise, just with a wider stance. Hold number five, chest down, elbows down to knees, hands to the ground, fingertips up, fingertips down, hands out in front of face, working from the ground up, hands at 12 to six or one to seven, straight lines back to the center of lower chest, and create some rhythm, tap, tap, tap. My hand's just tapping the ground. As it taps, I'm making contact with the ball, bring it right to the lower of center chest. Straight lines. Fingertips up, fingertips down. The body is quiet, hands are working. Now we're gonna incorporate the V slot, setting up in our launch position, working on moving our feet, working on timing of the feet and separation. I'm gonna make contact with the ground. As I come up, my feet are gonna move. Notice how my hands are working down, palms are working down as I move my feet. I'm gonna incorporate a ball in my glove. Feet a little wider than hips, slightly toed out. Hands center of chest, hinge at the hip, elbows to top of knees. We're gonna open it up. When my glove hits the ground, I'm gonna make contact with the ball, bring hands in a straight line, center of lower chest. I'm gonna move my feet into my V slot. Staying in posture, keeping my chest down, working from the ground up, eyes down, glove down, working posture. 